Hey, Logan from Reef Breeders here, and today we're going to go over our Reef Power RPM, how to set it up, how to program it, and how to maintain it. First, we have an unboxing. So here's the packaging, and you're simply going to want to open it. First component is going to be your manual, which we'll set aside for now, your Reef Power controller. the pump itself, your hardware pack, and your power supply. To install your new pump, simply remove the magnet, being careful to position the rubber grommets on either side and place it in your aquarium about one-third of the way down. Mode F1 is constant flow. That means the pump will be running at a constant output. In this mode, you could adjust the power up and down by using the up and down arrow keys. The frequency will not have any effect on this mode. Mode 2 is regular pulse mode. This is designed to work with one pump running independently. You could adjust the speed of the pulse by adjusting the frequency. A higher frequency number correlates to a longer pulse, and a lower frequency number correlates to a faster pulse. You could also adjust the power of the pump in this mode by using the up and down arrow keys. Mode 3 is an anti-sync pulse mode. This mode is designed for having two or more pumps using the master-slave functionality that is built into the controllers. This can be adjusted in a similar fashion to mode 2, however please note that this mode is not available in the timer function. Mode 4 is called nature mode. It is best suited to LPS and mixed reef aquariums and consists of a wide variety of randomized flow patterns. Mode 5 is called reef mode. It is similar to mode 4 except it changes more often and can be a bit more erratic. That means it's more suited for SPS and other stony corals. In mode 6, your pump will run your pre-programmed timer settings. For more information on how to program your timer and a more in-depth look at the Reef Power RPM controller, watch our second video on how to program your Reef Power RPM. Mode 7 will run your pump in reverse. Please note that this function is only intended to be run for short periods of time, no longer than five minutes. Running your pump in reverse helps clear the very bottom corner of your tank of any remaining detritus. It also helps clear your impeller of any obstructions. Thank you all for watching. For more information on the Reef Power RPM and our other products, please visit our website at www.reefbreeders.com. And as always, thank you for choosing Reef Breeders to power your tank.